today we are going to be figuring out one of humanity's most unsolved mysteries. Who makes the best donuts? We're going to be going to five different donut shops today, testing their donuts and seeing who has the best donuts. But first, let's gather the boys. Cock doodle doo people, it's the early morning. Who wants some donuts? <laughs> Anyone want some donuts? No? Damn, I might just be me today. I said... Who wants some donuts? <laughs> You do! Yeah. Welcome, welcome! I feel like we need some more friends. Would you mind hitting that honk for me? Does anyone else want some donuts? Anybody out there? Oh, Jeff! Did I hear donuts? Let's go get some donuts! Get in the car! We need one more person on our adventure. Last call! Does anybody want some donuts? You want some? No. We got the whole squad. Let's get some donuts. All right, boys. Before I start driving, can I have one of these? Jeff, James. So today we're visiting five different donut shops. We have Krispy Kreme, Dunkin' Donuts, Yum Yum Donuts, 7-Eleven. I feel like that one's kind of nationwide. I had to throw it on there. And then we also have a local donut shop called Best Donuts. Thing is with donut shops is there's like the big chains like Krispy Kreme, Dunkin' Donuts. And then besides that, I feel like it's mainly you know local chains around the country. What is everyone's prediction for first place? Best Donuts. Best Donuts because it has the word best in it. I hope they live up to their name. If they don't, false advertising. We're suing. Whoa. I'm gonna say best donuts too. Yeah, they're all going for the local. For me, growing up, probably would have said Krispy Kreme, but local spots just are honestly better. Yeah, yeah. local spots just hit different. Krispy <laughs> Kreme is gonna get second. I yeah, think. you can't go wrong, especially you know fresh from the shop. I think Yum Yum's getting second. I've actually never, I've never been, been to Yum Yum, but I know there's a bunch of them. I got to go with Krispy Kreme for first place, man. Hey, but gas station prediction. donuts hit too. 7-Eleven. If you guys ever been to like Quick Trip, Quick Trip donuts. Is that that Coast? That's like Midwest. If you know, you know. Quick Trip Donuts are there about. What would y'all say is your favorite breakfast food? Favorite breakfast food? I think I would have to go with a French toast. A mean French toast. I'll be honest, looking at Dunkin' Donuts, I tried this croissant sausage egg cheese sandwich. Smack. It was busted. <laughs> it was bro. slapping. When I just think like my go-to, that's that's what I'm thinking. A bagel of. with cheese, cream cheese, and like some eggs. You guys ever had one of those? Eggs on the bagel? Yeah. With the cream cheese? Usually it's one or the other. Yeah. If, if you add cream cheese, it's gotta be by itself. Out of all the breakfast foods? Dude, I don't know, like a bagel with locks and onion? That slaps. Literally the first coffee shop we go into, two police officers in there. Ah. Cops love donuts. Not just a meme, bro, it's fat. They don't even need parking spots as well. <laughs> Yep. So today we're gonna be rating our donuts on presentation one to three, dough one to five, frosting one to five, and then we're gonna rate their glazed donut one to five, and then one of their variety donuts one to five for a total of 28 points. And I'm actually pretty excited. It's my first time at Yum Yum, and this looks delicious. Shall we try the glaze first? Offer it one presentation. You don't do the presentation list yet? No. I don't really know how to judge presentation for donuts. I, mean, I feel like they all come like the exact it's same a way. Donut, I feel like it's but like, I've seen better. Does so the donut look? Yeah, appealing. I guess like this frosting is pretty like translucent. Not what I'm looking for, I guess. I'll give it a two. Mm. Exceptionally mm. mid. I wouldn't call it mid. It's it's exceptionally mid. Mm -mm. That is a good donut. The outside should be a little bit crispier. Should have some hold. I feel like the dough is solid though. That dough dough. That dough dough. Do not disrespect the donut. Get it? Donut. You don't know what you're talking about, James. <laughs> I, I might not. I might not. <laughs> hey, I did a dough dough right there. All right, now this is the question. Is this going to have some good stuff in the middle? Oh. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Alright guys, I got yeah. apple fritters. These are very slept on. My favorite donut. You gotta try the dough from two different types, because my dough is a lot better on this donut than it was on the glazed one. This chocolate donut would be awesome if it was like a glaze and chocolate combination. Dude, this slaps, bro. <laughs> this is like this is the best donut I've ever had in my life. My glaze was better. My glaze was better than my variety. I had to give the variety a three. My variety was so much better than my glaze. My favorite number, 17, is my score. I got my score. Yeah. Uh, okay. 23. 23.5. <laughs> That's going to be hard to beat. On to the next one. You said yum, yum. <laughs> Up next, we are on our way to Dunkin' Donuts. Honestly, not too excited for this one. Me neither. I'm not that excited. That's everyone's excited. I used to live above a Dunkin' Donuts. 
donuts when I lived on the East Coast, and uh, oh, okay, yeah, I feel like it. not often. I feel like Dunkin's probably like good based off location. Like some Dunkins are better than other Dunkins. Yeah. Dunkin sucks. I'm just gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's just trash. Coffee sucks. The donuts are Coffee abhorrent. Is dog water. Coffee bro. is awful, bro. Dunkin <laughs> used to go by Dunkin Donut. That's still technically their name, but if you actually look at their stores, they all just say Dunkin now. They literally took the word donuts out of their name on like most of their storefronts because they know that shit sucks. Do you think there's people out there that like Dunkin Donuts? It's all these people in Massachusetts and New Jersey, bro. They're so f they're stuck in the colonial days. I don't know what's wrong with them. Guys, we have lost the Dunkin Donuts sponsorship opportunity. <laughs> you know what's kind of weird? It's raining in the middle of summer in Southern California right now. Is it raining? It's actually kind of pouring. I didn't even check the weather because it's been- going to Dunkin Donuts. Mother Nature. <laughs> <laughs> Mother Nature said too. Ah, that summer drizzle is hidden knife. Alright, we gotta give a shout out to Trav because we are all dry right here, but my man Vans is getting poured on in the rain. <laughs> We're safe. Um, everyone grab a glazed donut. The presentation looks I don't know if it looks better. I kinda <laughs> like the look of the glazed here better, but these variety ones are just You know what I noticed straight away? Like the last place had the glaze only on one half. This one has it all around. Yeah, this is a lot better than I remember. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Donuts are slapping me down. No. <laughs> I honestly don't think the glaze flavor is that bad, but it's so thick and doughy. It's, it's not light. Yeah, I agree. It's inside. too doughy for me. I do love these. Oh my god. This man, <laughs> Jeff, is gluten. Like, he's not supposed to have gluten, and he's eating more donut than anyone. I've been trying to pace myself, but <laughs> donuts have been hitting Donuts? But you still got the fritter, bro. How much meat for Duncan? Yeah. It's like a bread circle. It's not even a donut. Like, I feel like, especially since I know this is going to be some thick ass dough, this is not enough. Frosting to dough ratio is completely off. Look how heavy it is. Yeah, I do gotta admit it's very dope. I would still eat it. Do like not get me process. wrong. I would yeah, destroy guys, these. One hundred percent. Going through five different shops, shops, these would be demolished. One hundred percent. We put on our critic hats when we yeah. do these videos. We're very critical. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff's gonna have like eight thousand calories today. Dough is dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I gave the dough a two, frosting a two, glaze two, variety two. All twos around the board. But we still gotta go to 7-Eleven. 7-Eleven looking a lot better than this right now. James gave it an eight, I gave it a ten, Chris gave it an eight. Jeff, what'd you give it? Minus 15. On to the next one. Bro, how y'all feeling about Team USA? Your dog did. <laughs> I haven't watched any of the games, but I'm extremely disappointed as an American citizen. <laughs> <laughs> well, honestly, to be fair, it's just not their style, you know? I think, like, USA would go a longer way if they just pick nothing but, like, young guys. I feel like United States players, see the NBA players, are always trying to foul bait, and then FIBA, they're like, dude, what are you doing? Oh, they don't score? call them in FIBA? Oh, hell no, bro. Yeah. Foul baiting has been getting out of hand, and it's NBA. not fun to watch yeah. at all. They should adopt the FIBA rules, honestly. So that donut. What donut? Yeah, it was so bad you forgot it. <laughs> <laughs> I, was just, I was caught off guard. Let's see if 7-Eleven can be better. Do your wipers work, bro? <laughs> 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 well, I'm not used to having to use them. <laughs> Driving with just no, like, you can't even see through his windshield, <laughs> All right, fellas, we are at 7-Eleven, but we didn't come here right when they opened, so the selection is a little limited. A lot of the donuts have already been taken. This is what we got. We just got some glaze and some chocolate. But, hey, they're made daily here. That's what it says, so we're gonna try them anyway. Not as much variety, though. Usually when I go to 7-Eleven, the selection is a lot bigger than what it was today. That's okay, because we got the glaze and a variety. We're gonna start off with the glaze. Are y'all ready? Yeah. That's horrible. That's so fucking, it's just like bread. Mm -mm -mm. No way. You like it? There's no way. I want to spit it out. <laughs> I, oh, I, spit, I spit mine out. You want to spit? Damn, you spitting it out? Nah, this is definitely the worst one by far. It's so bad. Let me try um the long one. I don't even want to try it. Do I have to? <laughs> you have to try it. Dude, dude. what the f are these clucking gluten claws? Did you say clucking? Want a little taste? All right, give me the bag. I feel like the chocolate one's better than the blade. Dude, this is just bread. I feel like to make it good, you would have to go like this. And only eat the top part. Hey man, I don't know if I got a horrible taste, but it's not the end of the you world. Over here. Just like five star on dough, five on glaze. That was terrible. <laughs> Jeff likes it. 
Nah, dude. Let's go back to Duncan, guys. No, Duncan was actually a lot better than that. I gave mine a 10.5. That's my lowest. <laughs> you rated 7 Eleven higher than I rated Duncan. Dude, I'm giving it a 6. This is an all time low score on this series. Oh, I gave it a 5. You all gave it a 5. I gave it straight ones. Ones all across. Dude, honestly, like going into 7 Eleven, I was like, all right, I know 7 Eleven hot dogs and all their food is such a meme, but like, surely, like, you know, people buy it, they sell it. It can't be that people buy it. Bad news the local donut shop that we were going to go to is actually closed today, so we're just gonna find another local donut shop. All right, this one's called Gladstone Donut. Seems to have good reviews. Let's try it out. I have a conspiracy about Talk Kanye West. You know he's been wearing a mask and shit lately, and then just like a bubbly ass jacket. He's doing that so he can start being in multiple places at a time. Some marshmallow type shit. Some marshmallow type beat. Like there was clips going around of him being in that stadium for like the week straight. No, I thought he was finishing his album. I'm saying like if he's going to like these public events and shit, like who no. knows if that's really him. I feel like Marshmallow is actually such a genius for that. Like, he literally can just have an army of him. Oh, yeah, DJ set? Dude, no one gives a fuck. Just tell him what to fucking play. I don't know about y'all, but for me, just the classic pink box. Low key. I'm giving it a three on presentation. Dude, the glaze looks amazing. Yeah, the glaze, the oh, presentation. Oh, the texture is Ooh, phenomenal. Oh, it's soft. It's soft. And it's glazed all around. <laughs> Delicious. The texture is great, but the taste is not. Yeah, good. I, I think I it's actually it. lacking on taste quite a bit. The dough is great. Though. Yeah, like it's great, like texture, presentation, but the taste is not that good. I disagree. Right, variety, I'm pretty excited. I got bro. a foot donut. Anyone has a foot fetish? No, you're jealous of this donut. Here we go. A whole pie, bro. Jesse definitely got a foot fetish. Why do you think I got this? I'm trying out the Fritta that Jeff gets. I've never had one. Would y'all consider this a donut in the comments? I, yeah, it is. Definitely a donut. It's sold at every so, donut spot. It's so, I was there foot fetish so over weird. here. <laughs> Look, I feel like it's fair to count it toward variety. Like, if that's what Jeff gets. Damn, if Damn, you're funny, I've been sleeping on that. I can't even hit Jeff. Great call. You know when you guys lick a popsicle that's made out of wood? Don't you get the chills? Wait, like, what? <laughs> Yo. I'm, I'm a little gluten, all right? You know when you lick the popsicle stick that's made out of wood? Doesn't that give you chills? Like, I have, like, I get chills. First of all, <laughs> I don't know what kind of. Pops you were sucking on? No, a popsicle. <laughs> oh, a popsicle. Yeah. Oh, okay. Like the splinters are gonna go into your tongue because nah, like the wood. I don't get a sensation. Yeah, I don't really eat in fear like you do. <laughs> Just thinking about it. What was that? What the f is wrong with you, Jeff? Man, I need some more support, man. <laughs> First time on the series, bro. We gotta break you I in. Mean, yeah. The last stop, we are going to Krispy Kreme, but unfortunately, it's like an hour away, so we're not going to the actual store. But Trav picked up a dozen donuts for us, so we're going to the house to get some Krispy Kreme. It's gonna be absolutely delicious. Dude, I literally don't have a corkscrew at my house. I was trying to open a bottle of wine last night, and I was using like a torch to light the air under it. Well, the thing literally exploded, and glass went everywhere. I did not know that was gonna happen. It was terrifying. Are you retarded? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we are here for Krispy Kreme. What is this? It's a donut. I'm gonna try oh, out yes. the glaze straight away. Oh. Oh my god. Am I the only one who thinks it's just literally okay? Yes. Alright, this is what I appreciate about Krispy Kreme. None of the other places did this. We got a chocolate donut, but it's also a glazed donut yes. at the same time. Yes, it's like the little thing. Thing. The little things. The little things like that. It's so sugary, but goddamn, mm -hmm. it's magic. I guess I'll try a sugar donut. One cinnamon sugar and one's regular sugar. Alright, what? what the fuck was that? I'm the sugar off. Oh <laughs> my donut! <laughs> bro. You're not just flinging your skin on my donut! <laughs> I thought my hand was over you. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. Dude, the presentation is just classic. I feel like they have some beautiful donuts. Give them that a three. Oh, is that custard filled? Oh my god! <laughs> oh, Jeff's going crazy. No, I will admit their dough is mid, but yeah. sugaring and stuff just makes up for it. I will give them the highest grade on presentation. They definitely won the presentation battle. You know, if I take anybody from out of state and they want to get donuts, I just take them to Krispy Kreme. Out of all these places, <laughs> man, I came to California to try something new. You guys just bring me to the same old places I had at home. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm eating up everybody after this. <laughs> you know, next time I bring someone from out of state, we're going. To our <laughs> Boys, the scores are in, and it was actually a very close race. Coming in last place, 7 Eleven, with a score of 6.6. .6. Next up, we have Dunkin' Donuts with a score of 10. In third place, we have Yum Yum with a score of 16.1. Wow. 
It is between Ladstone Donuts, the local donut shop, versus Krispy Kreme. The winner won by one single point in the votes. In second place, we have Gladstone Donuts with a score of 17 and Krispy Kreme with a score of 17.2. They are our winners today. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching this video. Let me know who you think has the best donuts down below in the comments. Two other videos are popping up. Shout out to the boys for being in this one. We'll see you in the next one. Take it easy. Peace.